people often ask about outdoor kindergartens is do they cover the curriculum the same way as an ordinary state school would and the answer there is yes. Um, I encourage um, nurseries to audit what they do in terms of snacks and walks and how they get ready and how they run their nursery against any curriculum and you will find that most of the work is covered. For example, the children every time they go on a walk are likely to learn about road safety and how to be safe beside roads. They learn to manage about, they learn to identify wildlife and nature because they're using natural materials. Um, a lot of the time the resources we use are different. We use natural materials but we find that actually that can really help children in terms of their creativity and their imagination. So I have a stick here and if I had a car in my other hand, the car that a child would use is almost always likely to be used as a car. It might be a Batmobile or a turbocharged super woofer car but it's always going to be a car. Whereas a stick, one day it could be a wand, the next day it might be a lightsaber, the next day it might become um, a toothbrush. It can become anything a child's imagination wants it to become. So it has much more, it encourages creativity and imagination when children play. And you might think, well, that's okay, children play. What about the cognitive developments? So I often do a simple experiment with a stick and you can try this at home if you want. You take a stick and you break it into a three pieces because we don't want to be too difficult here. Okay, so here we have a three piece stick. We mix it up and then you swap it with somebody and then you see if you can put their stick back together. And funnily enough, it takes a lot more challenge to try and put together a, a stick that's been broken into three pieces than it is to make a three-piece jigsaw. So that's kind of like a nature's jigsaw. And what we find is that children, because natural materials aren't uniform, you find you have to think that much more carefully when you work with them because things don't fit together perfectly and, and you have to constantly make adjustments and try again and things like that. So actually, I think the standard of education often can be higher through the use of natural materials.